Uh, shout out to Covered Floors for filming that. Hi, my name is Covered Floors, and today we're going to be using the Dehancer Pro plugin to emulate film. We're going to color grade some clips that I used from a recent music video. The Dehancer team reached out to me to review it. I'm pretty excited too, and you'll see what I laid on in the video. So yeah, at the intro, I'm using a new uh, film emulation plugin called Dancer Pro. I thought it'd be interesting to show first time like beginner user of the plugin. I had a music video recently. I thought that would be pretty cool to use it on. I did want a pretty like interesting look. Even right now, as you can see, like I don't know much about the plugin. I don't want to go too deep in the plugin. I just really want to show like, yeah, just how a beginner might run through this. This is how it was presented to us and it's already pretty interesting and it's, it's not through like a no tree. It has just a plug in like an effect bro. This is how it's presented with all these options. I'll be real, I've not gone through every single one of them. I don't know exactly what they all do. I I like to just more explore and I don't know, just make bad stuff bro and see what happens. What I wanted to do, here's one interesting look I have. I just want to go through and try and quickly like grade something just for you to see how I ran through this plugin as a beginner and got these sort of looks. So in the first drop down here um, it will show you a couple like color spaces but at the bottom you can pick a camera. So we'll go through I used a Sony what camera I used the A7S3 and then you can pick like the profile that you shot it in pretty interesting to play around with these even if you do pick the wrong ones i still think they give like pretty cool looks just from doing that that's what we have so far here's a couple more like things we can play with the names you can read them and you know what they do if you don't just play with it and you, you'll see what it does but just from doing just the first tab bro got an already pretty like interesting cool look so this is the third tab that i went into you can see the options here click enable I do like darker shadows so this is pretty nice for me gamma correction color separation I don't fully know a lot of these options I don't know fully what I'm doing but just playing with it I know what I want there's a manual provided in this it will run you through every single option it will tell you what it does I'm yet to go through it but I will but for now I'm just happy to explore just all the options. I don't play with any temperature adjusting, so I'm just gonna try some now. There's something real rough, bro. I like adding green to a lot of my shots. A bit of a weird, like, I don't know, I'm seeing like a weird red that I don't really want. And to fix that, I was going to this option, whole separate tab, color head. And it just lets me play with like colors, like almost like individually, it feels like. I'm not sure, but I'll show you. So it's not the best, but there was a bit of red that I'm seeing, and there's the red now, and there's the red sort of gone. So we haven't gone through like many options at all. We've opened up three tabs out of the over like 12 or like 15. That's it, I think. We've already got an interesting look, bro. Um, so we'll go to another scene same thing I'll, I'll play this scene now just so you can see what's happening it's pretty cool bro i'll show another example not the same color grade but yeah it's just nice to see it in motion so there's a couple other clips i just want to like show you the results that i'm getting with using the hanter as a beginner, it's been so quick just to get like really like interesting looks like these. Here's one in the water. I just want to go through and play some of them like just at the water. Here's another clip. Um, this was shot by my friend Paris. Thank you for this shot. Um, just on the side here. Same thing, Dehancer. 
Looks crazy, like it looks great, bro. I'll full screen that and play it. It's just been real quick to make interesting looks. And that's what's making me really like want to stick to this plugin. Thought well, this would be a cool shot to use the color grade on. Moon in the back, reflecting on the water, artist in a yellow boat. I think it can't go wrong, bro. But yeah, just by just by looking at it, I think you can tell, bro. The enhancer, it's really friendly to use, bro. In my opinion, it's not difficult. It's very easy just to go through the tabs, play with stuff, and understand what they do. I want to mention as well, before this video ends, the enhancer have an iOS app that you can edit either a photo or a video on. And I'm just going to go through now and just quickly show you, like, it, it is uh, similar to what you do on the PC, but I'll show you. So I went to a concert recently, and we'll get an interesting clip from this. And already, you can see there's like a couple different presets already preloaded. Click on a random one. Mm. Let's try this. Looks cool, bro. All different kinds of looks. And it's real quick, bro, and it's just nice, bro. Convenient on the phone, and bro, filmmakers on the phone will use this. Once people find out, it'll be real nice. So that's the Dehanta app that you can get separately for iOS. If you're a filmmaker on the phone, I encourage you to look at this, bro. It's very convenient, it's easy, and yeah. So on screen right now, I'm just gonna have like, just a compilation of clips that I've used the enhancer on. You can see for yourself, as a beginner, <clears throat> I've achieved these looks, and I'm sure as I like get deeper and learn how to use this plugin, I'm sure the, the looks will become more refined. I've, I'm really enjoying the enhancer. I mean, just look at the results, bro. They look, they look great, bro. And I'm sure like there's millions of adjustments that can make it look even better that I'm yet to learn. If you want interesting looks like these, bro, the answer pro is the only thing that I've used that's like, let me do something like this. I'm gonna leave a link in the description below. If you wanna buy it, bro, the link is there. Thank you for watching the video. Thank you for the Dehancer team for asking me to review this. Really appreciate that. My name's Cruz and this is me using the Dehancer Pro plugin to emulate film.